I am pleased to bring you guys the 2004 Championship Pistons, my GM. Yes, guys, we talking like Chauncey Billups, Rip Hamilton, Tayshaun Prince, Rasheed Wallace, Big Ben Wallace, and the man himself, Mr. Number 2 overall pick after LeBron James, Darko Milicic. Be sure to hit that like button and that subscribe button if you want more of this series because I'm not sure if you guys want to see it or not because I'm, I'm not sure if you guys are as big a Pistons fan as I am, but man, this was my team back in the day. So I did my best to mimic the roster to make it look like the 2004 Pistons. So uh, there's a few cases where the guys might not look exactly like they are because the uh, player customization mode on this game is not really the best, but you know, you work with what you got out there. So yes, yeah, so we're going to be doing this. It's going to be the 2015 season. So it's like going back in the past and bringing in the team to the future to see how they do. But yes, guys, here's the roster. Here's the roster from 2004. We even got the bench player, man. We got Lindsey Hunter. We got uh, Mehmet Okur. By the way, my mom used to tell me I look like Okur. I don't really think I do. Uh, but you know, that's the story for another day. Uh, we got Big and Nasty. Big and Nasty. Corliss Williamson. Uh, we got who we got. And the players actually look pretty good, too. They look pretty realistic, I think. We got Eldon Campbell. Uh, Chucky Atkins, who else we got here? Bob Sura, man, he was a point guard on the Pistons back in the day. Darko Milchis, told you guys about him already. Y'all know about him, biggest boss of all time. And Mike James. We got the doghouse out there, man. They, they, they used to call him the doghouse. That was like the bench unit, man. Like back in that 2004, that bench unit just went out there and grinded, man. But I'm excited to use these stars. Like we got Tayshaun Prince in his prime. Big shot, Mr. Chauncey Billups, guys. Like, oh my God. I'm so pumped for this. I've never been more pumped to do a My GM series. Like, I love My GM mode, but I, I was just like sitting here. I was just like, man, I'm going to do something different. I'm going to use this team, and I'm doing it. And uh, we have Stan Van Gundy as our coach for right now because, you know, he's. I'm kind of surprised with his stats out here. Like, his stats are not very good. I always thought Stan Van Gundy was actually a pretty decent coach, especially back on the, Orla or the uh, Orlando Magic. Uh, but this series, we're going to be doing a lot of games. Like, it's not going to be like my typical My GM series where I sim a lot of games and do a lot of trades. This series is pretty much going to be a lot of games because I don't want to do a lot of trades because I don't want to break up this unit to, or whatnot. Uh, but we're going to do a quick little scrimmage right here just to get a feel for the players out here, see what they look like. And, uh, man, like Rasheed Wallace, like I can't put like a headband down because the player creation mode's not all that good. But you got that nice little fadeaway right there. You all know Rasheed Wallace was the master in the post. And actually, on this roster, Rasheed Wallace is rated the highest player. And let me explain that a little bit here. Let me explain why that is. Because Rasheed Wallace had potential to be one of the greatest power forwards of all time. I mean, some of his skills out there, his skill set was amazing for a big, seven, you know, he's a seven-footer out there. And uh, he was just kind of lazy. You know, sometimes he just would not go in the post where he should have. And look at Tayshaun Prince again, that green line every time. He would not go in the post when he needed to. Um, he would settle for the three-pointer. So we're going to look to... You know, because we're coaching the team now. You know, I'm Coach Crispy Flakes, and you all my Crispy crew out there. We're going to look to bring Rasheed Wallace's potential in full light and see what we can do with it. You all got big Ben Wallace grabbing that rebound. That Ben Wallace actually is looking pretty good right there. And, uh, look, oh, my God, Tayshawn. I've not seen you dunk like that in years, man. I don't think i ever seen you dunk like that. I know you can throw it down, but, damn, that was nice. Uh, but like I said, guys, let me know in the comment section below, do you guys want to see this series? Because if you do, heck, I'll be posting a lot more. Look, look at Darko. Oh. Oh, damn, Darko, you just posted a Big Ben Wallace. If you could do one that, man, maybe you could have made a case for that number two pick overall, but, damn, I know you had that, didn't you? Uh, but, yes, uh, we're going to be doing our first game. The first game is going to be going up against the Denver Nuggets, so they're not all... Look at Mr. Big Shot. Throw it down, boy. Shoot it down, whatever you got to do. Uh, the, the Denver Nuggets are not really all that great of team, so I think it's going to be a good game to really get a feel for this team. And what the heck is Darko doing shooting threes? Dude, Darko, what are you doing out there, man? Get, get in that post, boy. Actually, get on that bench, if you want to be quite honest. Uh, but yes, man, like Rip Hamilton. We're going to have Rip Hamilton coming off the screens like he did back in the day. Yo, I might be sounding like a little fanboy right now. I might be sounding a little bit too geeked up. But I'm going to tell you, like, this is this team made me fall in love with the game of basketball. I was 12 years old, and I saw this team. And I, I have not looked back ever since, man. So it's really a big moment for me to be able to bring this to you guys, to be able to share the memories. Because I'm going to be talking about some of my past Pistons memories and all that good stuff. You know in future videos i really am looking forward to it and let me know in the comment section below what is your favorite team of all time what team just makes you think like this is the reason i started watching basketball it might be a team right now maybe you're a big golden state warriors fan and you just love that team right now or maybe it's a team back in the 80s if you're that old then hey more power to you but yes guys stay tuned for the next episode of the 2004 pistons my gm series peace out